When it comes to driving on the highway, two things are virtually guaranteed. Heavy rush hour traffic and billboards. Dozens of billboards sponsored by the Minnesota Department of Health have dotted the Twin Cities landscape for the past several months. In today's Health Check, Delane Cleveland tells us more about the advertising campaign. Towering high in the sky along Highway 169, a billboard encourages people to get a colonoscopy. It's not something you talk about around the dinner table. It's kind of, you know, yucky, it's impolite. Laura Friedenberg of the Minnesota Department of Health is one of the masterminds behind the ad campaign, which has some notable visuals of people's derrieres scattered all throughout the Twin Cities. So we're trying to have an eye-catching campaign that'll make you turn to the person sitting next to you and say, Hey, you're 52. Have you ever had a colonoscopy before? She says that's important because 2,500 Minnesotans are diagnosed with colon cancer every year. And about 850 of them die from the disease. About 60% of those deaths could be prevented if people aged 50 and older followed the screening guidelines and got screened regularly. Yet the ad campaign isn't just about colonoscopies. Nearly two dozen billboards encouraging people to get immunized have also sprouted up along the metro area's highways. The Minnesota Department of Health receives about $5 million each year from the federal government to fund its immunization program. Only this year, they decided to devote some of that money to a billboard campaign. As far as anybody can remember here, um, it's, um, this was the first time that we've done um, billboards. It's part of the health department's mission to maintain high levels of immunization in Minnesota. We basically have 70 to 80 percent vaccination rates in Minnesota. However, we know that we can do better. Um, our goal is to get to 90 percent. The jury's still out as to just how effective these billboards will be, but one thing's for certain, they're pretty hard to to miss. Most people really like it. They say it obviously got their attention, it got them talking. What it got them talking about, we don't really know all that much. For Health Check, Delane Cleveland, 12 News. The colonoscopy billboard campaign started in March and it runs through the first week of September. Meantime, the immunization billboard campaign cost about $100,000 and it began last month and ends this week.